Hello and welcome back to Productive Dragons channel where we do unboxes, plan with me's and other things. And if you like that, please consider subscribing. Today we got our abominable book boxing. You want to see what's inside? Come join me. Abominable Book Club is a horror book club. I have the bare bones, which is two books and a used book. Bookmarks is included. So this should be the December 2023 box. It comes from the UK. See if I get away from the microphone. Right. We normally get two books and, like I said, a used book, which is nicely, nicely packaged like that. So there's that. Let's see if I can find. Oh, oh, we got a patch. Edward Scissorhands and Freddy. Yay! I like that. Okay, we have a letter. I'm looking for a bookmark. Ah, here we go. Found the bookmark. All right, with a little story on the back. We have a signature, which I'm trying not to look at. And I think that's about it. But let's grab one of the books. And it is, I'm not going to pronounce this person's name because I'll butcher it. Uh, Nails and Eyes. A young girl loses her mother, and her father blindly invites his secret lover into the family home to care for her. As she obsessively tries to curate a pristine life, the new interloper remains indifferent to the girl, who seems to record her every move, and she realizes only too late all that she has failed to see. With masterfully na na narrative control, Nails and Eyes builds to a conclusion of disturbing power, paired with two additional stories of unsettling minds and creepy tension. It introduces a daring new voice in the Japanese literature. Ooh, and it's translated. Which, Kindle, I'm not going to try to pronounce this guy's last name. <laughs> I'm assuming it's a guy. So, that's pretty cool. Okay. Hmm, all right. Oh, and it looks like we have, there's variety there. So, okay, I've seen this one. I actually had this as a net galley arc. I didn't make heads or tails of it. <laughs> uh, all right, next, we have Desert Creatures by Kay Kronstinner. Okay, all right. And that would be the signature for this one. Okay. An unknown devastation has swept across the United States. A sickness caused the dead to flower and sprout fruit. And the promise of miracles draw pilgrims all over the holy city of Las Vegas. We're in trouble. <laughs> Magnolia and her father flee their home in the Serona desert setting out across the wastelands in search of a cure for her disability as they pass through blasting cities and ruined towns they are forced to join a group of survivors making their own pilgrimage but the road to las vegas is full with danger strange cults occupying the wreckage of towns and uncanny stuffed men roaming the desert as strange sickness begins to take hold, the band of survivor grows even thinner, and months turn into years. Magnolia finds herself pacing, placing her trust in the most unlikely places, and the closer she gets to holy destination, the further from salvation she seems. I would say so if you're thinking a holy city of Las Vegas. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but it is what it is. <laughs> Okay, let me go ahead and stick this right in here so I don't lose it. And the letter is also from the um, author of this book. So. There. All right. So those are those two books. Now for this one. Okie dokie. Let's see here. let's see which book i got this day all right hmm. 
The Winner Guest by W.C. Ryan. Okay. January 1921. Though the Great War is over, in Ireland a new civil war is raging. At once, Gran Kilgrun, Kilgrun, I'm saying it wrong, I'm very sorry, house now has half empty and filled with ghosts. The Prendenville family is left reeling from the IRA ambush that takes place on the grounds and their beloved daughter Maud is killed. When Captain Tom Hankin, a shell-shocked former soldier and mob's former fiancé, is sent to investigate, he becomes an unwelcome guest in the gloomy household. Can he find out the truth about Maud's death before the past and his strange, unnerving surroundings overwhelm him? Hmm. That is interesting. When was this written? This was written in, oh, 2022. Huh. Okay. So here is the, I don't know what they want to call it. I've, I've heard someone say a used book, so I'm not really sure how they want to call this one. And then the books that we got are bookmark and a patch. Oh, and the letter for this one. What did I think? It's, it's interesting. This is going to be a very interesting uh, read, especially this one. And... Sorry, but been to Las Vegas and Holy City is not what you think when it comes to Vegas. But all in all, I liked what I got. So what did you guys think of the selection? Let me know in the comments below. Like the video. And until next time, I hope everybody is having a wonderful day.